Hello everybody, welcome back to another Mystic Islands trading card game video today. Today I have a special announcement. I've actually already announced this, but um, I think it was two videos ago. But now it is official. I'm recording this on March 1st. It might go up on the 2nd, like really early in the morning. I'm trying to get it out on the 1st. We'll see how that goes though. I'm a little busy today. But today we have something amazing. Boom, right here. Game Crafter package, of course. And guess what it is? Right here. Booster packs. Now, guys, these are different to my normal booster packs. So normal booster packs for my game are purple. And they have Ritual Madness on the front. I'll show you. They usually look like this. Right here. That's what they usually look like. And, you know, they're still available on the Game Crafter and everything like that for six dollars and it comes with 10 common cards six uncommons and two leaders or rare cards or two rare or leader cards same thing but um leaders are the hardest cards to get in the game obviously you can only have one in a deck so they're very obviously powerful because they're limited to only one in a deck so these right here are called mystic madness pack now, this is a special edition booster pack limited edition as you can see right there you probably can on camera um so these are limited edition only for march so today's march 1st it's going to be over as soon as the last day of march hits 12 um in the morning boom gone it's gone so it will not be coming back until the next year which the new set will probably be out by then um so you'll never be able to get these set one mystic madness packs ever again after the month of March in 2021 so now that we got that out of the way um, the difference in the packs is we actually get rid of a common um, in the normal pack so you have nine commons still have six uncommons but you get an extra rare or leader per pack so the odds we get three leaders in a pack goes up by a ton it's still only like six percent but it has happened my neighbor did it and um, kind of sucks because it was one of the packs I was going to open, and I was like, you know what? You can just open it. And then uh, he got three in a row. So I was like, oh, well, okay. So we'll see how we do in these real quick. So let's see which one we'll pick first. This one got a little bit messed up recently. So we're going to open that one first because it is the odd one out. So let's do that. So just an FYI, if you guys are looking to purchase these, um, they are first link in the description. Be right under Mystic Islands on the Game Crafter, of course. And these booster packs are actually selling for the same price as the regular booster packs. So you don't have to pay any more for a better, basically just a better product. So that's pretty sweet. So you got to get them while you can, guys. Let's see. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate the support from everybody. We almost have 100 subscribers, and I would love to hit 100 subscribers before my birthday, which is March 24th. I'd really appreciate that. That would be sweet. So these are the fresh new cards. They smell great. can already smell them. All right, we're going to flip it around. And we get a rare right off the bat, meaning that we're not going to get three liters, but that's okay. Ruby of Misfortune. It's a very good rare. I love the effect on this card. It really looks like it's glowing like even if it's even though it's just a flat image it came out very well in my opinion so that's a rare so we'll put that like over here grateful scallywag and uncommon it's pretty good disassemble another uncommon we get a common restful grizzly actually a very useful card useful card sorry frost atronach Another very good card there. Primary Foot Soldier. Common. We get a leader right here. King Edwards. We like to pull this guy in these packs. Uh, last time we did an opening, we pulled a King Edwards as well. So that's awesome right there. So we're going to put that off to the side here. Let's just move everything over. All right. Hopefully that's good enough for you guys to see in a minute. Mighty Lizard Brute. Uncommon. Another Uncommon Fireball. Very good card. Common Axe-Wielding Dwarf. Common Death Whisperer. I don't think you guys have seen this guy in a opening yet. He's very sweet looking. Girlfriend drew him. 
very talented artist, as I've said before. Really appreciate it. Peaceful Spellcaster. And another leader, we have King Gwizeki. So we get King Edwards and King Gwizeki in the same pack, which is pretty sweet because they're kind of polar opposites. This guy likes to deal a lot of damage and he likes to gain a lot of health. So that is sweet. So we get two leaders out of our first pack. That's really great. We're getting a really good pull out of these guys. Uh, Frontline Brawler is a uncommon. Goblin Nightcrawler, uncommon. Get an Aqua Mage. A Wizard Outcast, one of the best commons you can get for sure. And a Dwarf Coal Miner, that's the last card for that pack. So obviously we're doing great already. I mean, already two leaders. In normal packs, um, a leader shows up in one in every four packs. So we just got two in one pack. So obviously you can see the value shoots up dramatically. Alrighty, finally got this one out. I'm gonna open it backwards again. Get this off to the side. Alrighty, before I show it, comment down below what card you think this is. Oh, we get Gadney the Warrior. Probably no way you guys guessed that one. <laughs> but that is a rare Dwarf Faction. So we're not gonna get three leaders, but that's okay. Dwarf Blacksmith, again. Dead Man's Wish. Another Death Whisperer. That's interesting. Good right there. Needed more of him anyway. Backstabbing Goblin. Good common. Pyro Screen, a really good common for the mages. Goblin Chain Twirler as a rare. So we only got one more chance of getting a leader in this pack. But he's still a very good rare, so. Drunken Slumber. Ooh. From the Depths. Very good card right there. Hopefully you guys can see these. Dwarf Boar Warrior, a common. Another common, Bloodthirsty, the, probably the best common in the game, honestly. Another Wizard Outcast, very good card. And a rare Magni Bronzebeard. So we end up getting the both of the Dwarf rares um, in this pack, which is pretty hard to get. So that's pretty awesome. That's pretty great. So no leaders in this pack, which is okay. It happens. Undead Mummy Spaz. What's that? Skeleton Rogue. Dustin Knight. Powerful Warrior Herd. And our last guy is Primary Foot Soldier. Just a 1-1. One -one, gains you a life. If you guys are enjoying the pack opening videos uh, on my channel, I really appreciate it. Um, and hit that like button if you want me to open up more stuff. I love opening up booster packs. All right, let's see what we got in this pack. We got a leader right off the bat, Captain Blackbeard. First card in the pack. It's a pirate leader. Look at that. We got three leaders already. Peaceful Spellcaster. Grunt Goblin, my man. The man, the myth, the legend himself. Grunt Goblin. Kingdom Guard. Skeleton Arrowist, a very good card. Wicked Witch, also a very good card. And a rare Goblin Chain Twirler again. So that's going to take up a leader spot. So we can get up to two in this one. Grateful Scallywag. What's that? Fierce Troll Brute. Standard Skull Soldier. Ghost Rider. War Torn General. Dead Man's Wish. And Ruby of Misfortune. So we're not going to get another leader. That kind of sucks. It's okay though, because we get a fireball right here. Get a stranded soldier. Very nice. Dwarf boar warrior. And a dwarf coal miner again. So, I'm going to run through the rares and leaders real quick. It's kind of weird that we only got um, specific rares. So we got two ruby of misfortunes right here. Which, I love this card, but not the greatest rare. Probably the least effective rare. We're going to get two Goblin Chain Twirlers as, we as well. Can't talk today. So that means we got both rares for the Pirates. Or for the Goblins. Oh my god. And we got one of each rare of the Dwarves. Which is pretty weird. And then we get a Captain Blackbeard. King Gwizeki. And a King Edwards. So that's three whole factions that we have leaders for now. 
So that's such a sweet pack opening. Hopefully you guys did enjoy that one. Let me know your favorite card down below. Uh, mine personally, I think it might have to be King Edwards, guys. He's probably my favorite art. But let me know down below your favorite artwork. And remember, these are limited time only. If you want to get the most value for your money, you got to act right now during March and purchase these packs. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Peace.